Hi there, my name is Kastutis and in this video we are going to talk about the top programming languages, their pros and cons, and career prospects. Let's get started! As the demand remains strong for coding-related jobs, many people are looking to enhance their CVs. Even if you don't want to pursue a career in the field, learning programming languages will help you develop your problem-solving and logical skills. So, I've listed the top 10 programming languages that are worth learning. Let's go over the first one, Python. Did you know that a lot of world-class companies like Google, Spotify, Dropbox, and Facebook use Python to structure their website's backend? Python is a high-level, general-purpose programming language that works for both simple and complex tasks. From data analysis and visualization to web development, prototyping and automation. Apart from being that versatile, Python has a clean and simple syntax that's even similar to English, so it's accessible for beginners. Among software developers, it is also a popular scripting language which means it is used to manipulate, customize, or automate facilities of an existing system. Additionally, Python is open source, so programmers can freely modify its source code to fit their needs. It also has a robust and supportive online community, with more than 2 million GitHub repositories to assist you during your learning process. That said, Python is not an ideal language for building mobile applications. It also performs relatively slower, as it is an interpreted language. By mastering Python, you can explore various career paths, including data scientist, software engineer, web developer, or artificial intelligence researcher. On top of all that, Python developers are in high and growing demand, with an average salary of more than $96,000 a year. JavaScript is the most used programming language in Stack Overflow. That's not a surprise, as around 98% of all websites use JavaScript for their client-side scripting. Some of them include Google, Facebook, Instagram, Netflix, and Amazon, which use Java code to build their website's front-end. This scripting language is often used to improve a web page's interactivity. For example, adding animated graphics, clickable buttons, or hover effects. Once you master JavaScript, you can raise the bar by mastering its libraries or frameworks, like React for front-end development, Node.js for the back-end, or Electron for web applications. That said, JavaScript code can be interpreted differently by different browsers, leading to unstable performance. Despite that, it is considered an easy language to learn, with plenty of online resources available from bootcamps and courses to YouTube video tutorials. A JavaScript programmer can earn around $90,000 a year, with a wide range of career options, including UI and UX design, full-stack development, or software engineering. Swift is among the more recent programming languages in today's market. It was launched as an alternative to Objective-C, which was the primary language for Apple software products. It offers modern features like concurrent programming and automatic memory management. Even though it is not the only language for iOS development, Swift is still arguably the best and the fastest growing one. That said, Swift lacks support for older iOS versions, and since it's a relatively new language, there are frequent updates as well so it might be difficult to find tools compatible with it. If you wish to build a career in Apple product development, consider learning Swift as your first language. Apple provides an official Swift development program, in addition to an iOS app development course that also includes the language fundamentals. iOS app development is in high demand, with Apple being the biggest revenue and profit generator in the smartphone business. As an iOS developer, you can expect an average salary of $70,000 per year. Go, often called Golang, was created for developing APIs, GUI-based desktop applications, and web applications. While it's a recent one, Go is one of the fastest-growing programming languages. 
Its syntax is similar to C's, with changes made to make it more concise and readable. One of Go's best features is concurrent programming. It enables programmers to work with multi-core CPUs and a massive codebase. Combined with its excellent performance, Go's concurrency makes it the perfect coding language to create algorithms, web servers, and data pipelines. That's why it is a reliable language used by large-scale apps like Google, Netflix, and Uber. Fortunately, Go is relatively easy to learn, especially if you have Java or C knowledge. Its downsides include limited library support and a lack of generic functions. Due to its high demand, Mastering Go gives you a chance to reach an annual income of almost $100,000. Some of the best job roles include software engineer, data scientist, backend web developer, and AI researcher. Java is a high-level, general-purpose programming language owned by Oracle that enables the creation of all sorts of applications. From software engineering and backend web development to data science, Java can do it all. This programming language also has robust security that makes it widely used for financial services. Java is an easy coding language because of its syntax familiarity with real-world tasks and object-oriented structure. Widely known to be right once run anywhere coding language, Java can run smoothly in any operating system regardless of where it was written in the first place. However, there are two things to note about Java. It has slow execution times and it's often memory consuming. The demand for Java developers remains high with the average annual pay of more than $90,000. Some of the job roles you can explore after mastering Java include Software Engineer, Quality Assurance Analyst, Project Manager, and UX Designer. If you are interested in mobile app development, particularly Android apps, you can choose Kotlin. It's a general-purpose, open-source programming language designed for the Java Virtual Machine. It combines object-oriented with functional programming features. Due to its many improvements, it's considered to be faster than Java. It's also lightweight, and its code is more concise. If you are familiar with Java, learning Kotlin will be a quick process. For total beginners, its straightforward syntax means you'll face a shallow learning curve. Kotlin is Google's preferred language for Android development, so career opportunities should stay on the rise. The average salary of a Kotlin developer is around $30,000 per year depending on your skill level, location, and years of experience. PHP is considered by many one of the essential backend languages to learn. It's a very popular language used by 78.1% of all websites, since it is the primary language for WordPress and nearly all of its themes and plugins. This language also offers many frameworks for websites and application development including Laravel, Symfony, and Codeigniter. PHP is relatively easy to learn. In addition to the extensive resources available, its syntax is elementary. But creating a website using PHP is slower than using other languages, and you'll have fewer debugging tools available. In terms of job opportunities, the demand for PHP developers remains high, despite being one of the oldest languages in the industry. A PHP programmer can earn around $80,000 of average annual income. C++ is the enhanced version of C and considered the foundation for many programming languages like Java, Python, JavaScript, and more. So, by understanding the concepts and fundamentals of C++, there is a high chance you'll easily master other top programming languages. What's more, its versatility makes C++ the best programming language to learn. It has a fast and powerful nature that lets developers create applications with excellent performance, like video games, graphic software, and web browsers. C++ combines low and high-level language characteristics, making it excellent for system programming while allowing abstraction for smaller projects. Plus, it's a multi-paradigm coding language that supports object-oriented programming, generic, and imperative programming. 
Learning C++ can be a bit challenging for beginners, since it has a more complex syntax than other programming languages. In terms of job opportunities, C++ proficiency remains necessary for many IT professionals, including software developers, game developers, and backend developers. The average income for a C++ programmer is nearly $90,000 a year. C-sharp is an object-oriented programming language. That means it uses a model that organizes software design around objects. It is one of the top programming languages due to its fast performance and improved stability. This language is also easier to learn than its predecessors, C and C++, with a simpler syntax and well-defined class hierarchy. It started off as Microsoft's language for its .NET framework, but c -sharp is now compatible with Windows and Linux. So, it's safe to say that c -sharp is the best programming language to learn for developing GUI-based desktop applications. You can also use it in various environments, including mobile and enterprise software. Put simply, it's possible to create Android and iOS apps and develop 2D or 3D games in Unity. That said, as it's dependent on the .NET environment, it might not translate well cross-platform. Many software companies are continuously seeking c -sharp experts, like software engineers, game developers, or mobile app programmers. You can expect an average annual income of nearly $85,000 by mastering this programming language. Last but not least, Structured Query Language, or simply SQL, is the third most used language according to Stack Overflow. It's the best choice if you're interested in data science and statistical computing. It lets you query, manipulate, and analyze data stored in a relational database. For instance, web developers use SQL to organize websites' databases, while digital marketers can use it to analyze their marketing campaigns. Numerous database management systems, including MySQL and MariaDB, use SQL. Learning SQL is extremely easy, as its syntax uses common English words, and it has a large user community to assist you during the learning process. On a side note, SQL is not an open source language, which means you can't really modify its source code. So, it's not the best programming language to build applications. In terms of job opportunities, companies from all industries look for SQL developers to take care of their database management. So, it's fair to say that SQL developers are in high demand. The average annual salary is nearly $90,000. And those are the 10 top programming languages to learn. Tell us in the comments below which language you are planning to start learning first. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to share it and give it a thumbs up. For more awesome content like this, subscribe to the Hostinger Academy YouTube channel. I wish you good luck on your learning journey.